this is Trisha, the Essential Skills Mentor for Focus Forward in the Fundy region with another Essential Skills lesson for you. For today's lesson, I will show you how to install the Flash Food app so that you can save some time and money when you're shopping for your groceries. This app is also great if you care about the environment and you want to help re reduce food waste. So the essential skill we're using today is digital technology. There may also be some numeracy involved in this if you're following a budget while you're using this app to shop for your groceries, and we'll discuss that in another video. This app allows you to buy food from your local grocery store that is on super sale, so the items are often half of the regular price. To download this app, you want to go to your Play Store and search Flash Food. The app will come up and mine says open in that little green button on the right there because I already have the app downloaded. If you don't, it should say install and that's what you want to click. It will take a few minutes to install, but once it does, you'll notice there's this map here and your phone will likely choose the nearest store for you already. But if it doesn't, you can move this app around and you can zoom in or zoom out and find your nearest store. So as you'll see here, my closest store is the Superstore in St. John. So I would click on that at the bottom there. And then all of the options that are available for you to purchase are here and there's photos of them. So the first one, for example, is some produce. So some apples and oranges. And they're showing that they're now $2. They used to be $4. And their best before date is April 6th. So if I wanted to buy this, I would click on the item and then there is uh, the option to add more. Now if I wanted to and I click on that, the app tells me that there aren't any more of this item. That's all the surplus they have for today. So I'll click OK. And if that's all I wanted to buy, then I would go to this green button down here and click Add One to Cart. And then if I'm finished shopping, I would click the green button again where it says One Item Shopping Cart and it will give me a summary of what I'm about to buy. It tells you that the flash food savings, so what you've saved already before tax is $2, and my subtotal of what I'll have to pay is $2. So if I'm satisfied with that, I'll go to the green button near the bottom that says checkout. And at this point, you would wanna put in your payment method. So you would need a debit card or a credit card, and you would click here, uh, again near the bottom where it says add a payment card. You would fill out the long number, the 16 digit number that's on the front of your card up at the top here. I have an option to choose where I've used a Visa card on here before. Then this where it says MM slash YY, that would be the expiry date of your card. It will have two numbers slash two numbers. And then on the back of your card, there's a small three digit number so there would be three numbers there, and that's what you would type in where it says CVV here. After that, you would click Add Cart, and the app will allow you to go through with your payment and let you know when you can pick up your items. Thank you for watching this video on digital technology, and I'll see you in the next video.